What up guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Viva the Flower. Are you curious about what you need to know to enter the dental hygiene program? If yes, then let's jump right into it. So first we're gonna talk about the classes you need. So you're gonna need bio, chem or physics, and English and French. And of course you need your high school diploma, like the you're gonna need your vaccine for hepatitis B, um, your tuberculosis, tuberculosis test, <laughs> and you're gonna need your criminal record check and your SIMDIT. I'm pretty sure I'm saying it in English and French right now, but I think you guys know what I'm talking about. Second, let's talk about the length of the program. Here in Ontario, it's three years. It doesn't mean that it's three years that you have to put your whole life on hold whatsoever. You can still do what you have to do, but it's really a lot of like dedication, devotion, and like stopping the procrastination because like I procrastinate still, but it's still like it's a lot of work. It's a lot of like a lot of hours that you have to put in. So if you're not ready for that, then like sis. Three, let's talk about money, sis. The tuition is like 3K a year. So it's like three years times three, it's six. <clears throat> and I like moved out of my parents' house. So it's like more expensive. I have to pay for rent and all that. So you gotta put like some money aside during high school. You have so have to like consider like um, OSAP. And you have like to have savings because it's gonna it's gonna be a lot of money. <laughs> there's also passive income, sis. Like, if you didn't know already, there's many ways to make money on the internet right now. So you don't necessarily have to have a job if you can't get yourself a job, but you can, you know, find your ways, like, keep keep the money flowing, you know, in your bank account. Number four, your books and your material and your scrubs. So let me be honest with you guys. I have not opened any of the books that I bought. I literally have like, let me not try to count. I have like around 10 books and I haven't opened any of them. I use some of them if I have like certain things that I need to read, certain chapters that my teachers are like, okay, um, you guys need to read this chapter because it's gonna be helpful for whatsoever. I read it, but I have not touched any of my books. I think it was a waste of money. I even have a class right now I don't even, I didn't even buy the book because I knew I wasn't gonna use it and I have the internet to help me. What I mean by material is like your kit. Like at first they're gonna give you a big, big bag of all the things that you need to use, all the instruments, the dental form. I'm gonna answer it right here so you guys can see what it looks like. Um, and it's just really fascinating because they're like, you can't open the bag. You have to wait until like we go in clinic whatsoever. And I'm like, okay, I'll see what's in the bag. So I opened the bag and I saw like what was in it. I think I have a snap of like the first time I opened the bag, but it was really thrilling because like when, when somebody tells you, you can't do something, you're going to want to do it. But either way, I didn't really use the like the boxes, the instruments because you know, they're like kind of nice. That whole big bag that I'm talking about is around like almost $3,000. So get your money ready, sis, cause I was not ready for it. I was really not ready. I think I looked at the price of the, like, of the bag on the paper they gave us the first day of class and I was shook for my life. I was like, where am I gonna find this money? I don't even have a job. Like all the money I made that summer was like for my apartment and I'm just like, I can't pull money, so. Anyways, that's all to say to get your money ready when you're in high school, like, you know, save up because you're gonna need it a lot when you enter the program. But I'm grateful I have my family, had. I have my family that are still able to pay for some of the things that I need to. And along the way, I got money, so I was able to like pay them back. Because at our school, they offer scholarships and it's awesome because like every session I get money. <laughs> Free money sis! So yeah, I'm really, really happy for that. Now let's talk about your scrubs. So they first tell you that you need like two of everything. So two tops and two bottoms and then black shoes and black socks. Make sure you have your black socks because when you sit down, your pants go higher and they can see your white socks and it's just like disturbing. You have like black socks, I mean black shoes with white socks and it's like, there's something off. 
Oh, there's also gloves and masks in um, like security glasses, if that's how you call them. Um, your gloves are gonna last you a very, very long time, especially for your first year. So you can only buy like one box. But when it comes to your mask, because you change it all the time, you're gonna buy, you're gonna have to buy yourself like three boxes or like two boxes of, of mask. And like, it has to be level three because you need to protect yourself from the client. I'm not saying like, not to make it sound like bad, but that's how it is. Prevention. Now let's talk about number five. The last thing you need is support. Support from your friends, from your family. When the people around you know what you're doing and how like confident and how much you're going to devote to it, they tend to like give more support, you know? Like sometimes you're gonna have to spend an all-nighter and it's gonna be rough. Like you're not gonna wanna do anything. Your brain is gonna be fried. You're gonna wanna just go to bed and just give up, but you gotta keep it pushing. And when you have those people around you that knows what you're doing and that push you, it really helps and it like, it brings a smile, you know? Sometimes I would have to wake up, like I would sleep earlier to wake up at five in the morning to study. And like, my brain is like, I can't focus. But I have people that send me a bunch of paragraphs and it's so cute and they're saying like, you know, keep it pushing, you know, don't give up. And it's just like, it warms my heart. So make sure you have a support system because you're really, really going to need it. So that is it guys. Thank you so much for watching my video. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.